Oh, this looks so good. Oh, this is honestly so rich, so creamy, and so refreshing. I think even if you don't like green smoothies, you will really like this. Kind of inspired by the Hailey Bieber smoothie. I love like the white coconut cream. So pretty. Anyways, I got my period today, and I don't know if anyone else is like me, but I always feel so sluggish and tired when I get my period. And I almost canceled Pilates today, but I always feel better whenever I do go to class. So made my smoothie. I'm going to relax for a bit, and then we're going to go to class. Honestly, so creamy, so good. Give it a try. Honestly, Pilates has been such a game changer. It has really helped me with my cramps and I'm so glad I went because that was a really good session. Anyways, I don't know if anyone else is like me, but whenever I'm on my period, I always crave spicy noodle soup. Something about spicy food that I just love, especially when it's that time of the month. And I also have some zucchini in the fridge I wanna use up. So I thought for lunch we can do maybe zucchini pancakes. Anyways, it's currently 1.30 and I'm starving. So let's get cooking. I'm not the biggest fan of zucchini. However, if there's one recipe that'll get me stocking up on zucchini, it's my super crispy zucchini pancakes. The secret to making it extra crispy is to squeeze out all the excess water. Next, add in eggs, pepper, garlic powder, rice flour, and shredded cheese. Add around two tablespoons of the zucchini mixture to make one pancake. Using the spoon, press down to flatten the pancake. Pan fry for two to three minutes on each side or until crispy and golden brown. And that's it. I like to make them in bulk and air fry them throughout the week. Next, let's make my spicy noodle soup in 10 minutes. Saute the onion and white parts of the green onion for 2 minutes or until translucent. Next, add in garlic and Korean red chili flakes. Mix until combined. Pour in any stock of your choice and bring it to a simmer. Once simmering, add in the noodles and add in any toppings of your choice. I had fish cakes and spinach today. And of course, we have to finish off with an egg. And that's it. Hi, I'm so hungry. I'm so excited. This smells so good. Do you like noodles too? He always sits beside me when I eat. It's like his spot right here, his seat when Dom's not here. Mm. Oh, this hits the spot every time. Spicy food. We got the crispy zucchini pancake. This is one of my favorite seeds, zucchini, especially when I have a bunch of zucchini left over in the fridge. And I like to kind of dip it in the spicy soup. Mmm. And it's also really easy to heat up, so normally I'll make tons of it. You can just heat it up in the air fryer and it still gets super crispy. So good. I'm drinking Taiwanese hibiscus tea. It's like my go-to drink in the summer. Really good. Really refreshing. You guys know the viral sound? It's like a reward. It's like a reward. It's literally this meal right now. So good. Anyways, I'm going to put on YouTube right now. My new recent obsession is watching people cook and eat as I'm eating. I've always been obsessed, but my go-to channel is usually I watch Remy's vlogs or I watch Kim Tai, which I've been binge watching her vlogs for the past weekend, but I'm gonna watch her mukbangs while I eat. See you guys in a bit.
So Dom's actually going out with his coworkers tonight and my sister's gonna be coming over for dinner instead. I think we're gonna be doing crispy fried chicken with a corn cabbage salad. Super refreshing and delicious and she loves corn so it's gonna hit the spot for sure. Anyways, it's currently 5.30 so let's get cooking. Marinate the chicken with soy sauce, black pepper, sugar, garlic, fresh ginger, and rice wine. Set it aside for 30 minutes while prepare the salad. If you didn't know, you can use a fruit peeler to get super thin slices of cabbage. Rest them in ice water for 10 minutes to get rid of the bitter taste. This is my favorite way to eat cabbage salad. After 30 minutes, add an egg and cornstarch. Mix well to ensure every piece of the chicken is coated with a batter. Coat the chicken with Japanese potato starch and dust off any excess starch. Deep fry the chicken for 8 to 9 minutes or until crispy and golden brown. The salad dressing is super easy. Add in soy sauce, black pepper, freshly grated onion, rice vinegar, sesame seeds, and sugar. Add on sweet corn and drizzle on the sauce. You should try Caprican chicken. It's honestly like the perfect bite. Mm -hmm. Cheers. Oh my goodness. The perfect summer meal. 